Hey guys, it's me Jake from Jakeman21642. Today I've got a video for you of this 2015 Subaru Outback. This one is a 2.5i limited model. As you can see, it's finished off in a crystal black exterior, which is a beautiful metallic color. Outside, this one does have tinted rear privacy glass as well as your chrome trim around the windows, body color door handles with intelligent entry built in. Up top, this one does have a sunroof and your roof rails from the factory, as well as your body colored mirrors with your turn signal indicators built in. And you can see too, in typical Outback fashion, it does have your cladding down below and Outback badges. Around the rear, your Subaru and symmetrical all-wheel drive badges, Outback and PZEV. This one does have a rear backup camera, as well as a power trunk. Just press and hold on the key, and it will release. And you can bring it back down from the key fob as well. Fuel cap is on the passenger side. You can release that from inside of the vehicle. And down below, this one is riding on Bridgestone tires. They are 225-60R18s, so 18-inch alloy wheels, rear disc brakes. I love the way these wheels look too on the Limited with the dark finishes. And around this side, everything follows through. Over here, this one does have your projector headlights with the LED daytime running lights and fog lights down below. Start this one up, it does include your typical Subaru key fob with lock, unlock, trunk release as I showed, and panic. You can release right here and pull the physical key fob out as well, in case the battery ever died or something. To get in, it is intelligent entry. Grab the door handle to unlock and touch right there to lock. Inside, this one does have the black leather interior. You can see your wood grain up top, Subaru door sills, and this one also does include your factory all-weather floor mats. You can see inside, this one is in great shape. To start, foot on the brake and press right here. Go ahead and close the door. Just have the key fob inside of the vehicle and you're good to go. And these newer Outbacks, especially the facelifted models of this generation, especially in the limited trim too, these are almost like a luxury car inside. It's very, very well appointed. And the amount of features you get too. This one does include the original window sticker. As you can see, 2015 Outback 2.5i Limited. You have your colors right there, all of your standard features. Fuel economy down below. And then the options, this one does have the option package 22 power moonroof package which gives you all of that and everything else down below for a total price brand new of about $34,000. Go ahead and put that back in the glove box so it will be included when this vehicle is sold. Inside this one does have a leather wrapped steering wheel, your audio system controls, controls for the menu display on your gauges, cruise control over here, and then paddle shifters on the back of the wheel. For the CVT transmission this one is equipped with Manual mode, you can use the paddles, and then reverse. This one does have a rear backup camera, which is nice too on this display. It's a very nice, uh, high quality backup camera. It's actually really helpful. Down below is your electronic parking brake as well. On the door and the limited, it's all soft touch material up top. Wood grain right here, and then your padded leather, padded stitch leather down below, and this is perforated leather on the door. Um, both of your automatic front windows, power windows, power locks, power mirrors, your power seat memory for the driver. Your tailgate, you can release it from right there, as well as the memory for how high you want it to open. Gauge dimmer. And then down here is your traction control on and off, blind spot monitoring on and off, which this one is equipped with. It also does have heated mirrors. And your fuse panel right there. Headlight controls are over here, and in typical Subaru fashion, which I really like this, you can turn them on, and when you turn the car off, the headlights will shut off with the car. So if you want your headlights on all the time, you can just leave it right there and it won't kill your battery or anything. Volvos do the exact same thing. That's a really nice feature. On the dash, you have this aluminum trim as well as the wood grain, which matches the door. Dashboard itself is all high quality, soft touch material all the way across. Two air vents, hazard controls, and then your gauges with your tachometer, speedometer. And then right here, this one does have 28,000 miles on it. Your start stop button right there. And then in the middle, this is Subaru's um, Starlink system. As I said, this one does have the Harman Kardon audio system as well, which sounds really good. On 
mean, it really does pack a punch. Go to the home screen. You have your map, audio, phone, different apps, info, settings. Map, obviously navigation. This one is equipped with different apps. A lot of these will work uh, once you have a Bluetooth phone connected. You can see Pandora, AHA, things like that. Dual zone automatic climate control down below. You can adjust from right here. As well as you have your different modes, everything else, and heated seats for the driver and passenger. You can control different zones and everything else. It's very simple, and the passenger has their own zone. Underneath of this wood grain cover, you have a storage compartment, USB ports, auxiliary in, and a power outlet storage, two cup holders, and then, as I said, the shifter for your CVT, electronic parking brake, as well as your X mode and uh, hill descent control. Actually, I believe this is your hill holder. Your hill holder right here as well. Padded leather armrest in the middle. Storage inside. It's all nice and lined and felt. You do have another power outlet in there. And then your change holder up top. Storage. The seats are very, very comfortable. High quality leather as you'd expect from Subaru. There are perforated leather in the middle. And then you have the nice stitching around the edges. Up top sunroof as well as your interior lighting controls and then your sunroof controls are right there sunglasses container and this one does have an auto dimming review mirror with your compass built in we'll go ahead and step out driver's side window down and pop the hood right here And in black with these wheels, this really is just such a great looking car. Inside of the rear seat, everything follows through. Padded material on the door, padded stitch leather, wood grain. The back seat does fold flat. You can release it from right here. Nice and simple. And inside, I'm 6'2". That seat's where I would sit to drive. I have plenty of space back here. It's very comfortable. And in typical Subaru fashion, the back seat sits up a lot higher than the front seat which isn't an issue for headroom, even in the model with the sunroof, because you can see you have kind of a cutout right here. But it's very, very comfortable. It's very nice for front passengers. If you've owned Subarus or been in the back seat of one before, you know what I'm talking about. It's really nice. You have an armrest in the middle, two cup holders built into there, and it's padded leather. The seats are very high quality. The same leather is up front. You have back seat pockets on both sides in the Limited, as well as heated rear seats in the Limited and rear air vents. The trunk, as I showed earlier, is power. Just press right there, and it will release it. Inside of the trunk, this one does have your cargo cover, which is very nice that's still with the vehicle. A lot of times, Cars just don't come with these nowadays, or people will take these out and just forget to put them back. That is included. It does have all four of your original carpeted floor mats, as well as both of your all-weather rear mats. This one also does have the all-weather trunk mat, and you can see the subwoofer for your Harman Kardon audio. These on the side pull. They will release the seats. Just drops down like that. Underneath of here, this one does have all of your storage. And then your spare tire is underneath of everything else. Go ahead and close that. Raise the back seat back up. Passenger side, you do have a full power passenger seat. Your Subaru door sills down below. Inside, this one does include all of the original owner's literature, window sticker, everything like that, and it's nice and felt lined inside of here. And up front, this one does have projector headlights. As I mentioned, the LED daytime running lights and fog lights. And under the hood, it does have Subaru's 2.5 liter boxer four-cylinder or horizontally opposed four-cylinder. Everything is in great shape, running fantastic. 
with the miles this one has too. It's very nice and clean under here. Is that? Bring the driver's side automatic window back up and cut it off right here. Move the key and headlights back into automatic mode. As always, this vehicle is for sale at Volvo of Richmond here in Richmond, Virginia. If you are interested in this vehicle, please let Volvo of Richmond know you saw this video. Thanks for watching.